Yeah, but it could, the village could have a different name. So we in Matura here. Oh, Bye. Matura. Right. We with we with Auntie Hillary. Auntie Hillary. Right. The pay me lady. Pay me. But she just do other thing besides pay me too. Everything. She doing everything. Yarding, everything. Yarding, work, everything. Cool pit work. Everything. So I here with my partner Sham. And he interested in okay. doing a little cool pit home too. Like he had to get EMA approval and thing, yeah, but like we got to talk about that after. Right. So you're right. putting in tree skid, right? Going this way? This, you, yeah, this way. Right. Put in the tree skid, mm -hmm. yeah? Mm -hmm. One, two, three. Right. Tree skid, mm -hmm. right? Your logs on them, your yeah, big logs. After you put a picket in the, in the back and a two picket in the back. Right. See how it is there? Mm -hmm. And you roll your wood on it. Mm -hmm. So you're rolling your wood on it, first floor. You're making sure it has no holes. No holes when you roll the wood. Right. When, you it up. when you say so no holes, you mean no gap between no them? No crease. They are the first lay. So you're cutting cutters like this, or could be a little bigger. Mm -hmm. And you're resting between your log after you're done roll your log. Right? So okay. it's closing up all the little hole there. Right, in between right? them. In between them. Right. Right, so you lay the first leg, right. and then you come now, you come and you roll, you roll the log on the second leg. Right. So while you're rolling the log now, you have to use wood like this, a little bigger. To chuck in between. To chuck in between. Right. That is for it, not to get no crease for sand or nothing to go down to out your pit. Wonderful. Right? Right. So you keep keeping that uh, height till it reach about. This is our height, six feet? This is how much you say? Yeah, about that. Uh, yeah, it's about six. About six feet, right? And then you put your barrication around. When you done pack, you put your barrication. So okay, you, you put the first row when you roll in the log. Yeah, right? so you roll it until it reach about this height. I telling you, this height. You're making your log come until your pull reach about this height. So that height the grow. Oh, that's that wood you packing. You no packing until you reach that height. Oh, this height okay. about this height. Okay. And then you have to put your stuff, plenty stuff. And top it. Where is the you put it? Like all dry leaf, all them dry leaf and everything. Right. You put all the stuff on, on top, top it. it right? And when you're done, put your stuff. Right. You dig and then you put your sand on top it or your dirt on top it. Right. right? Now when you're done, when you're done, let me show you. Not everybody know about cold pit, eh? Mm -hmm. When you're done now, but you don't pack your water, mm -hmm. right? You're making a mouth like this. Mm -hmm. Look at, I go near the cold pit mouth now, I open there. Right. Right? right. You make a mouth like that, right? Mm -hmm. You must make that mouth, eh? Otherwise, yeah. your cold pit will be a trouble. Right. So, and then you light your cold pit. Right on top it, you light your cold pit, you make a hole. You put little chips and you put wood and you light your cold pit. You have to put pitch oil or anything to light it, or you just. You can light it with pitch oil, yes. You okay. Can light, you light it with pitch oil. You light your cold pit, you have this open. So now, when you know your cold pit light, you will see the ashes from on top of the pit will fall and get hot. Right. So long as so you don't see the ashes falling down, your cold pit is light. You understand? How long does it take to light? Well, your cold pit, for your cold pit is light good, you have to keep your cold pit at least three good hours. So you know your cold pit is light good. So the ashes now will be coming down. There. So when day you put your hand and the ashes hot, you can close your cold pit now. Now we're leaving this mouth open on the side and you're covering your cold pit now the wood with light mm. with dirt or sand right. and you cover it. Right. So when you cover it, you leave this open. Right. Now this open is going to make your cold pit burn good. Mm -hmm. So you keep this until about, let me say, you light your cold pit one o'clock, one, two, three hours, then you close on top, right? And about seven, eight o'clock, you come now and you close back this mouth. You come and you close back this mouth. So this mouth stay closed. So that's why your cold pit burning there now. Right? Mm -hmm. Right. The next thing now, you gotta do. Let me show you. You gotta do what you gotta do. You like it? Right. We gotta get to this. You make two little holes on the side here. See our hole there? Watch yeah. it. Mm -hmm. You make two holes. You take put a stick. Oh, yeah. And you push it down. So your smoke will be coming out from there. Right. Two holes, one on the side and one on the other side. Right. So you know your cold pit starting to break there. Right. Now, if your cold pit should break, burst in the night. You cut a little piece of wood. I mean burst. It does burst because all What is burst? You mean inside here? On top. It will burst and make a hole. Mm -hmm. Oh, so it's dropping. Cut in. some wood. 
some wood like little blockage. Mm -hmm. Blockage now. Like this. Oh. Right? If it make a hole big like this. Mm -hmm. You could this come a blockage. Yeah. You take it now. And you put it in the hole. Right? More than this, if it make a big hole, if you make a small hole, you put little little ones. Right. But if you make a big hole like that, you put like this. Right. When you cover it like that, when you're done, you take up the same set of straw mm -hmm. and you put over it. And then you load it back with sand. You understand? So your cold pit come back there. Right, come and back you there. leave your cold pit there. Uh -huh. And your cold pit will be baking there. When your cold pit have three days, you come now and you open the mouth of your cold pit now. Right. Now, past the cold pit burning, you see the cold start dropping, the cold pit sinking. Right. So when it starts sinking, which means you're having colds. Right? So when you see it sinking, you're having colds. No. When it's sinking there now and having coals, you leave it. You make it for three days. After three days, you take off your barrication. You start one, two, and you draw your first set of coals. That's from the top. No, it's so which, you draw which... your coals. Hand me that rigby. So wait. So, yeah. Yeah. so wait. You draw come hand me this rig. When you now start the front here. Yeah, they had a the cover with wood too, yes. Does we block off yeah, like how the sides block, block off? Like the side block off. Okay. So you'll be drawing your coals. You're drawing your coals like this, baby. All right. You're drawing your coals like this. Yeah. You see coals? This yeah. is coals. Yeah. You see coals in the pit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're drawing your coals like this. This is coals, right? So you're drawing your coals. You're having your barrel or your hose with your water. Right. And you're drawing your coals. You understand? Look, understand. You're drawing your coals. So you're taking now your bucket from your barrel and you're wetting this. Right? So you're drawing it now until it come out. You're bringing it all here. You understand? Yeah. And you start picking up whatever you draw. Mm -hmm. So you pick it up and you put it in a pan like this. Take the pan. Mm -hmm. Then you flame it. You put it like this. And you put your pan and you start Picking up your coals. Nano hot? hot? No. This one kind of cold because it rain. You pick up your coals like this. It doesn't be hot, eh? So you're not supposed to put your hand in it. Why oh, put your hand in it? Because if you draw in it, you understand? <laughs> you put in your coals like this. Right? So you fold it in the span. When you're done fold the span, you'll take up water and it wet too. So you know the coals out. Because if you put it in it hot, it could burn the feed bag. Right. right. So you put it there and you tie your bag and you put your coals aside. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. And when you're done draw, and you see you're done draw out your coals, you're supposed to get five bag of coals the first time you open your pit. Long as the pit burn good, you're supposed to get five bag of coals. So when you don't take out a five bag of coals, you close your pit. You understand? When you close your pit, you leave your pit for the next two, three days burning. Right? But you get up in the night and you're watching it to see if it make no hole. Right. Right? If it get a hole, it is burn out. It will burn out clean. So yeah. you have to watch your pit. And when you don't get your pit, you don't sing it, your pit good. So the next two, three days, you draw out all your coals. So you get your whole set of coals. You understand? It's very easy. You understand? It's easy. Yeah. You understand? Cool, so on the sides... So right. the pit had to be like... You want your pit done, your pit had to be like... This, that, that, full up. And about this, I tell you. That high. That high. So this pit start that high and it. Yeah, I'm coming in. Right. Yeah, it comes. So the high. pit start so high and now it's just going down because the, the coal inside this burning coal. down. This have coals to draw. So this coals will draw either later or tomorrow, please go. Alright. Right? So when you take out your coals, you get coals like that. The coals there. You see? No. Coals there pack up in now the back. No, you pull any coal from the front here, but it, it has coal all in the back too. No, that burning. So while that burning, you keep drawing what house? What's dropping? Right, from so right. he understand, yes. He understand. But the other part's not burning too? Yes, yeah, it's burning. burning. But you can't open the whole pit. Yeah, okay. You take it out, see, like, soon as, as soon as the coals drop and it run, yeah. make coals, you take it out. So it's very yeah. easy. Coming forward to this side, that's right. Just pull it. Yes, mm -hmm. you just because pull it. I'm sure at the point in time when you make this, it will be probably out a little bit more, too. This yeah, yeah, come from it no, from look. yeah, calls come out from it. Yeah, you understand? Join from here coming forward. So, you join from there coming forward. So, it's very easy, it's simple. And you understand, and you yeah, understand because what so. you said, you understand. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Because and it had an extra um, up in um, where it Balanja, Alcindor. And we we check him and he was given we he um but I well, not everybody just give you a good opinion and a good idea yeah. i want call some people accident and i could tell you and i could show you 
Because my father was a coal burner. Well, that's the first so time he burned. That. Yeah, that's the you first understand? time he burned and coal right. too. So he now learned. My father was a coal burner. So I learned from that. All right. So, and I can tell you perfect. And what I tell you exactly. But when you have your coal's light, baby, don't sleep, you know. Mm. Yeah. Every three, four hours, get up and watch your pet. Otherwise. It's something funny. Tell you enjoy your coal. Right. Since it opened first time, you, you, you watch it until you like it. Until you pull out coal. When you pull out coal and you don't make it, you can go and sleep. You understand? Like but you're talking, you say three days and then two days. So in all, how long the pet go be here? No, you hear what I say? When he light his pet, right? Three days three after. Days after. You draw your first coal. You yeah. draw your first time. Right, you cover it back. When he done close up, he could two days, two days after. Yeah, after. You make an next draw. You make an next draw. You so, have to do that. Right. Like that. So you keep going like that until it's done. Right, so how much days and all? All right, like you say, this pet you have here. This supposed to last. At least one week and everything done. Oh. All right. But this said this didn't burn in properly. You understand what I say? Right. If it burn perfect, it will take one week. One week. And you're done. And it's done. And how much bag of coal you getting out of there? Well, in a coal pit, if you get it according to the sort of wood, this this pit you can get a little. Let me say twenty-five, thirty bag of coal. Thirty bag. Okay. But if it's bigger than this, you can get a coal pit with sixty. 70 according right. to the size and how you understand okay. it's easy what, what, what kind of wood you can use any kind of wood well wood? listen if i bought in a pet you use bora you use olive and the hardwoods and them the jumbi wood and all them things not bacano and them old no, babulat and them waste of time hmm. but coals is a good it's a good thing yeah what about um like for my me uh, uh, yeah, best coals. Mango, that is mango burning. Best coals too. Well, you're in the game there. For, um, watch, for a rock, best coals. Seriously? Yeah. Hey. Um, well, you're in the game there. I'm going to put it fire. All right. Thanks much, Emma Celery. Yeah. The coals, what can I do for a man? I really want to try that. Tell myself. No, I'm going to try. You think I I doing this as you? So this. Weekend, weekend. You can pick me up and I can come and show you. Yeah. Right. Yeah, no problem either. Right. So, but that is how I show you. It's a good thing. I'm going to try it. Right. So there's Auntie Hillary. You can try a small burn coal. You can try a small one, and then you come big. So it'll be real nice. Yeah, that was one. There's Auntie Hillary. Yes. Right here on the Toko, Toko Main Road. <laughs> Yes, Selling pay me, pone, pastel, pastel baby, honey, bay rum, Coca Cola. By the way, you are paying me, right? Yeah, I'll pay me. Yeah. Okay. We're signing out now. <laughs> See you all later. <laughs> <laughs>